news update on Just Events Online TV. I am Rukoya, she to first the news headlines. Buhari hosts new Niger president today. President Mohamedou Buhari received briefing from Jemi Hossi Bajo. Allegations against Governor Abdul Razak on truth says Kwara Noki. Ida organized prayer for Dr. Fatima, wife of Professor Gambari, Buhari chief of staff. Our lives are not safe. Accidents occur every day on the road. Residents of Okeadini Zango area cries out to the state's government. And on sports, UEFA announces new Champion League format. Now the news in detail. President Mohamedou Buhari hosts the new president of Niger Republic, Mohamedou Bazal, in the State House in Abuja. President Bazal was accompanied to the State House by governors of some northern states which shared boundary with the country. The governor are Abubakar Babuju of Kebi, Baba Gana Sulu of Bono, Abdullah Ganduji of Kano. May Malabuni of Yobe State, Aminu Tampua Sukoto, and Belu Mutawali of Samfara State. The Minister of Defense, Major General Bashir Sali Umagashi, Minister of Petroleum Resources, Chief Timi Simba, the National Security Advisor, NSA, Major General Babagana Mugunu, Chief of Staff to President Muhammad Buhari, Professor Ibrahim Gambari, and the Director General of of National Intelligence Agency, NIA, Ahmed Bufa Abubakar, were with the president to receive the guest. Bazaar was inaugurated as president of Niger Republic on April 2nd, 2021, after winning the election aired. Bazaar was inaugurated as president of Niger Republic on April 2nd, 2021, after winning the election aired on December 27, 2020, and took over from his predecessor, Mohamedou Yusufu. Vice President Yemi Osebajo on Monday briefed President Mohamed Bari at the presidential villa in Abuja. The president asked last Thursday return to the country after a 16-day medical trip to London, United Kingdom. The briefing held at the presidential villa Abuja was meant to update the president on the development while he was away. Kwara State Governor Abdurrahman Abdurazak does not interfere in the management of allocation to the local government council in the state. The state chapter of Nigerian Union of Local Government Employees, Nogi, clarified this on Sunday, giving light to the claim that the state governor was purifying local government funds. The union leader made the clarification to the general public that the monthly allocation to all 16 local government councils in Kwara State is being administered by local government representatives and all the union leaders at local government level are also observers at the monthly allocation meeting. Comrade Otonu O. Rafiu, the state secretary of the Kwara State Northern, clarified the statement. The resident of Oke Adini Community Zongu Ilori South Local Government Area of Kwara State has made a call to the state government on the situation of the road dividing wall that was disrupted by some people said to be the instigator of problems in the society. The construction of the highway, which was said to be a substandard job done by the past administration in Kwara State, led by Dr. Abdul Fattah Hamed, has now become a deplorable and a dead trap for its users. A resident of the community, Musa Buko, who speak with Just Defense Online News, confirmed how the portion of the road has been a disadvantage to the community, motorists and, and road by sellers. Commercial motorcyclists at Okiadini Junction, David Oyedeko, who also confirmed the state of the road, attributed late indiscipline, impatient of people as a major cause of why the road dividing wall was demolished to the deployed portion of it. Also, the Secretary of Tricycle Operator, Okiadini Junction, called on the state government as a matter of urgency to come to their aid as people's life is on risk every day. A special prayer was organized for the Emir of Ilori, Alhaji Ibrahim Sulu Gambari, the Kwara State Governor, 
Abdurazak Abdurrahman, Dr. Fatima Gambari, and other sons and daughters of Ilori Emirates. The prayer was organized by the Ilori Emirates Youth Development Association, IDA, as the annual Ramadan Thursday of the association was at the Eastern of the Indigent of Ilori Emirates, and at the IDA National Secretariat, and to Ilori Parastates. Leading the prayer, the chief missioner of the association, Al Haji Ibrahim, also, also prayed for Allah's guidance for the chief of staff, to the president Muhammad Buhari, Professor Agbola Gambari, and his wife, Dr. Mrs. Fatima Ashake Gambari, and other donors of Ida. And last on the news is sports. UEFA on Monday confirmed that a new format for the Champion League will be introduced from 2024 with the number of clubs in the group stage increasing from 32 to 36 despite an earlier announcement that 12 major clubs were planning to break away and start a rival Super League. The new format which will see all 36 club boards together into one pool instead of the current system of 14 group was approved at an executive committee meeting of European football's governing body in Switzerland. We have come to the end of the news updates for today. The news recap once again. Buhari hosts new Niger president today. President Mohamed Buhari received briefing from Yemi Osimbajo. Allegations against Governor Abdurazak on truth says Kwara Nogil. Our lives are not safe. Accidents occur every day on the road. Resident of Okiadin in Sambu area cries out to the state governor. He organized prayer for Dr. Fatima, wife of Professor Gambari. And on sport, the EFA announced a new Champion League format. Thank you for watching the news update on Just Events Online TV. Remember, optimism is a strategy for making a better future because unless you believe that the future can be better, you are unlikely to step up and take responsibility for making it so. Kindly follow us on our social media handles at Just Events Online. I am Rukoya Shetu. Thank you for watching.